driving theory preparation from sunrise training and exam support center Croydon. We are recording 27 questions. Topic other types of vehicles. Make sure you watch this video at least five times. And if you like this video lesson, please click the like button and also write good comments. 27 questions. Topic other types of vehicles. What should you do as you approach this lorry? Slow down and be prepared to wait. Slow down and be prepared to wait. You are traveling behind a bus. That bus pulls up at a bus stop. What should you do? Watch carefully for pedestrians. Watch carefully for pedestrians. You are waiting to emerge left from a minor road. But a large vehicle is approaching from the right side. You have time to turn left, but you should wait. Why? Because the large vehicle is approaching from the right side and it can easily hide and overtaking vehicles. The large vehicle can easily hide an overtaking vehicle. Which of these is least likely to be affected by crosswinds? Cars. In a windy day, least affected vehicle, car. You wish to overtake a long, slow-moving vehicle on a busy road. What should you do? Always remember, keep well back from large vehicle. Why do you keep well back from a large vehicle? So that you can see that it is clear. Keep well back from a large vehicle to have a better view of the road ahead. Why is it more difficult to overtake a large vehicle than a car? It is easy to overtake a car because car is small. But it is difficult to overtake a large vehicle because you need more time to overtake a large vehicle. It takes longer to pass the large vehicle. It takes longer. You are driving in the town. Ahead of you, a bus is at the bus stop. Which of the following should you do? The bus is at the bus stop. You have to drive slowly with great care. Why? There is a danger. What danger? Pedestrians. So you have to watch carefully for the sudden appearance of pedestrians. Watch carefully for the sudden appearance of pedestrians. You are towing a caravan. Which is the safest type of the rear view mirror to use? 
you will have to buy extended arm side mirrors extended arm side mirrors what can you see in the picture a junction crossroad what vehicle is on this junction a large vehicle so our question is about this large vehicle you are following a long vehicle approaching a crossroads the driver of the large vehicle signals right but he is moving close to the left hand curb what should you do you can only wait because try to understand long vehicles they need more space when they are turning as a good driver you will have to wait behind the long vehicle it's very windy you are about to overtake a motorcyclist what should you do you are driving a car you have less danger in a windy day but the motorcyclist is in danger in a windy day wind can blow the rider so don't go too close to the motorcyclist keep well back means allow extra room so this is question number 10 this video lesson is from sunrise training and exam support center croydon in front of you is a class 3 powered vehicle powered wheelchair driven by a disabled person these vehicles have a maximum speed of 8 miles per hour 12 km per hour 8 miles per hour what can you see in the picture there is a bus so question is about the bus when you are approaching a bus bus is signaling to move off from a bus stop what should you do allow it to pull away if it's safe to do so powered vehicles such as wheelchairs or scooters used by disabled people have a maximum speed of 8 miles per hour what can you see in the picture this is a mini roundabout what vehicle can you see at the mini roundabout it's a long vehicle and what side are the indicators showing indicators of the large vehicle are showing that this will turn to the left but if you look at the position of the long vehicle it is going towards the right so the question is you are approaching a mini roundabout the long vehicle in front is signaling left but positioned over to the right if you are behind this large vehicle what should you do you should keep well back what can you see in the picture a large vehicle is approaching from the side road if you are on the main road what should you do you have to slow down or be ready to stop our question is you are driving along this road what should you do 
What should you be prepared to do when you see a large vehicle is approaching? Slow down and give way. What can you see in the picture? I can see a mini roundabout. What vehicle is at the mini roundabout? A large vehicle. And the indicators are showing this large vehicle is turning left. But if you see the wheels of the large vehicle are in the right lane. If you are behind this large vehicle, what should you do? Our question is, you are following a large vehicle. It's going to turn left into a narrow road. What action should you take? You should be prepared to stop behind because large vehicles they need more space, they need more time and more space when they are turning. You are driving in heavy traffic on a wet road. Spray makes it difficult to be seen. What should you? What light should you use when you are driving on this road? You should use dipped headlights on a wet road. Spray makes it difficult to be seen. Use dipped headlights. What can you see in this picture? I can see a large vehicle and the indicators of the large vehicle are showing that this vehicle will turn left. But if you look at the position of the large vehicle, the wheels are in the right side. So this vehicle is in both lanes, left and right, and you are behind this large vehicle. Will you try to overtake? Will you speed up? No, that would be wrong. So let's understand this situation and the question. You are following a long vehicle. It approaches a crossroads and signals left. But this vehicle moves out to the right. What should you do? You will stay well back and give it room. Long vehicles, they need more time and more space when they are turning. As a driver, why should you be more careful when trams operate? Where trams operate, you have to be more careful because trams cannot steer to avoid you. You have to be careful. Question number 20. You are following a large lorry on a wet road. Spray makes it difficult to see. What lights you should use? You should use deep tight lights and also keep well back from the large lorry to have a better view of the road ahead. Drop back until you can see better. This video lesson is from Sunrise Training and Exam Support Center, Croydon. Question number 21. You are about to overtake a slow-moving motorcyclist. Which one of these signs would make you take special care? Triangular sign that is showing cross winds. When you see this sign, this is a warning sign. 
you have to take extra care when you're overtaking a motorcyclist. It's a very windy day and you are about to overtake a cyclist. What should you do in a windy day? Wind can blow the rider. So keep well back from the cyclist. Allow extra room. It's very windy. You are behind a motorcyclist. Motorcyclist is overtaking a high-sided vehicle. What should you do? In a windy day, always keep well back from the cyclist and motorcyclist. You keep well back while waiting to overtake a large vehicle. A car fills the gap. What should you do? You will increase your gap between your car and the car in front means drop back further. You are following a long lorry. The driver signals to turn left into a narrow road. What should you do? Do not overtake. And stay well back. And be prepared to stop. Do not overtake. Stay well back and be prepared to stop because long lorries need more space, more room when they are turning. Before overtaking a large vehicle, you should Keep well back. Why? Why is this? The reason you always keep well back from large vehicle for your own view. You can have the better view of the road ahead. Second, the driver of the large vehicle can see you in their mirror. And also... You want to be safe. You want to get the best view of the road ahead. Last question. Question number 27. You are following a large vehicle. Large vehicle is approaching the crossroads. The driver signals to turn left. What should you do? Remember, crossroads mean a junction. The large vehicle is signaling to turn left. Do not, do not overtake this large vehicle. It's a junction. We do not overtake any vehicle when we are approaching crossroads or a junction. So do not overtake when you are at a junction or when you are approaching a junction. We have completed 27 questions. The topic other types of vehicles. I wish you all the best Make sure you watch this video lesson for five times and write good comments if you like this lesson.